Did you forget to grease? Free hub. Whenever you're removing, either for service or to install a new cassette, loosen the lock ring, remove the cassette, make sure to check and see if there are any spacers between the cassette and the free hub because you'll need to replace that before you install a new cassette. Wipe the surface of the free hub with a clean cloth. Remove any residual grease, dirt, and grime. And then I use a lubricant uh, such as Park Tools PL, PPL2 and lightly lubricate the outer surface of the free hub. Now some people disagree with that and say leave it dry. My feeling is whenever you have metal against metal you should use a light coating of grease to prevent corrosion, rust, and increase performance as well as longevity. In this case we're going to replace the cassette with a single body SRAM we use single body because it's less likely to do damage to the splines of the free hub. We'll line up with the smallest spline towards the top and then we'll go ahead and reassemble. Don't forget to put a little lubrication grease or other lube on the lock ring tighten firmly as possible with your lock ring tool that is hand tightened and then using your adjustable wrench or other device we'll place this at about the three o'clock position and we're going to pull firmly down at least to about the six o'clock maybe a little bit more till we feel it nice and firm. You don't need to use super gorilla force so you never get this off but it should be firm to prevent any movement or wobbling. Another forgotten maintenance tip don't forget to clean and lubricate the quick release or if you're using a through axle the through axle get all the dirt and grime off using the same lubricant. We'll go ahead and lightly grease the quick release or through axle. What this does is it'll prevent any rust corrosion and will also decrease any chance of any noise that sometimes comes from a completely dry uh, quick Any other areas I might have missed that we should be greasing when we do our yearly maintenance? If so, please comment below. Please subscribe to keep up with our latest videos. This is Tony of Tony 10 Speed Safe Cycling.